Hello, I'm Will, I'm the World Book Geek, and I'm outdoors. By motorway, but I'm outdoors, at the back end of the Abbey Gardens in Barry's Nedlands. <sighs> Hello. Sorry about the car noise, I'm going to fix that in post-production. Anyway, I'm just here to talk about time travelling with a hamster. I was, I read this before and I was a bit cheeky and I asked um, Harper's Collins if they could send me a copy. And they so politely did, and thank you guys. Um, it's a very simple, it's a children's book, yes, but it's, well, I'll, I'll read out the blurb first. I suppose if you asked me before, I'd said a time machine, I would have said a time machine looks something like a submarine, or perhaps a space rocket. Instead, I'm looking at a laptop and a tin tub from a garden centre. This is my dad's time machine, and I'm about to change the world, well, mine at any rate. He has a chance to save his dad's life, but to do this he must travel to 1984. And I agree with this, it is an astonishing children's novel, it's so well written, the character development is beautiful, the writing style is, is so from the perspective of the age group of the character. It switches between his internal dialogue, his first person dialogue, and letters, and notes, and lists. He's a list maker. And it is just sublime. I'm shocked by it because I first read it, I think I was at a library and I had to hang around and there it was so I picked it up and read it. And I couldn't put it down. And with Harper's being kind enough to send me a free copy, I'm like, eek! So I thought I would have to talk about it. It is truly unforgettable. It's poignant, it's touching. It's just a beautiful little story and it's so wrapped in the modern age in the best way possible and the pop culture references just get me each time um, what else can I say I would rec wholeheartedly recommend this book it's just so well done and I'll put all my links down below as always so if you guys are interested in this book or anything else about my channel feel free to ask or follow one of those links and um, yeah so tell me guys what have you read this what did you think if you've read it are you planning to read it so i'm gonna leave that there i'm will i'm the bald book geek and i'll see you guys later